Ba 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 <coughs> welcome, welcome back, or welcome for the first time, I don't know. Uh, today we're gonna be starting Hellblade Sinuous Sacrifice. I'm stoked, I've, I've had my eyes on this one for a long time. Uh, apparently when, when uh, making the visuals and the audio that goes along with it, they've consulted uh, people suffering from psychosis and uh, neuroscientists and psychiatrists who specialize in that area uh, to develop the, the visuals and the auditory aspects uh, which makes me quite intrigued I'm looking forward to this it's gonna be cool uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and start it let's see what we got right Hellblade, Senua's Sacrifice. There we go. There it is. Also, it, uh, it revolves around like Nordic mythology. That's pretty cool. Here we go. Hello. Who are you? Welcome. You're safe with me. I'll be right here. Nice and close so I can speak without alerting the others. Let me tell you about Senua. Now her story has already come to an end, but now... It begins anew. What's happening? Journey deep into darkness. There will be no more stories after this one. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? They're watching. Why isn't she coming? She's doing this for him. Am I? Am I control? He's already can feel you coming. Quiet. I control the camera. Oh, how rude of me! I never told you of the others. You hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. Well, that's not quite true. Some are old, some are new, but they've changed. I think the darkness changed them, just like it changed her. Thank you. 
she thinking? I can tell you. She's afraid. Wouldn't you be? You'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years. But the darkness, it just builds onto itself, growing stronger, towering over her. You might try and ignore it, turn away. But it's always there, just out of sight, where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. You might think she's brave to go on this journey on her own, but it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Then it was fear runs far, far deeper. That's unsettling, that's ominous. This looks cozy. It's a cozy scene though. But what looks up at the corpses? The lighting is great. So great. What is she looking at? No one will judge her. No one will ever know. Oh, she heard us. There's no going back. There goes the boat. Fenua pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. There's nothing to go back to and worse to look forward to. Why don't you join us? Maybe you two have a part to play in this story. <laughs> that was cool. That was intense. That freaked me out. It freaked me out a lot. The lightning is great. So far it looks cool. It looks great. Let's see what we can do. Focus, kind of zoom. That's good. And that's about it. Look really clearly. Focus, Senua. Focus. Focus, and you'll see. What happens if you. Do focus? not forget my story, Senua. Because your darkness comes from hell, and your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to Hella's gate. But gods and the living will follow this path. You must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. After nine nights of riding, you will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim goes from there, across the River of Knives, that flows from the dark world of Niflheim. I recognize that voice, like a lot. Cool accent though. But, yeah, so Helheim, that's the uh, realm where the dead dwell in the mythology. Norse, is it, is that the word for it? Norse mythology? It might be. Let's go with Nordic for now. Because I know it's Nordic, you know. I don't want to embarrass myself too much. Oh, 
Oh. Run. I don't know. How do I run? I can't sprint. Oh wow, look at that. Did you see it? The land of mist and fog. The old fool was right. What was it he said? The river of knives across which lies the halls of hell. The place they call Helheim. So that's, I don't want to jump to any conclusions, but I'm guessing that's Dillian's head. And she's going to Helheim to rescue him from death, or at least his soul, I guess. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? Why doesn't she turn The back? camera work is great. That pan it did. It zoomed in on that structure and it kind of, kind of swirled around in a trippy way that was that was cool she needs to save his soul she wants his soul to be at peace she needs to lay him to rest he's already dead she can save him there's nothing she can do these voices man they <laughs> she'll never make it do you know where the bridge you are? to Helheim. Well, i forget its name she forgets too but she does remember that only the dead may cross it. That part wasn't so easy to forget. The old fool said there was a hidden path up to it. Let's see, shall we? This is oddly beautiful. I mean, there's still corpses out there in the water. But look at the scenery, look at the lighting. Look at the way they managed to pull off the water, like the shallow water, puddles of water on the on the beach. It looks insane. And also the character, like the, the character with the dreadlocks and the dirt grime on her arms. Yeah. I like it. I'm stoked. Another one of those stones. The Northmen speak of nine worlds. The world of men they call Midgard. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of earth, harvest, wind and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim. And that is where you must travel. I wonder who this old man is. Is it Sean Bean? 
that you, Sean Bean? Nah, probably not. Would be cool, though. Oh, it's a bit dark. The voice is in the background. A bit more optimistic when it comes to ladders. Oh, that's the hidden path, right, right. I'm not scared. Not yet. Don't know where you are. Where are we? Get down. <laughs> What's she waiting for? I like I like the <laughs> I like the background. She can't go back now. <laughs> no, I can't. This is it. The hidden part. Oh no, I can't. That's alright. Nothing good ever comes from looking back. There's usually nothing for you there. Oh, look at this. Probably leads to the bridge, right? It's going to hurt you. It's Don't kill me. I'm not one of them. Don't listen. I was just hiding. Find I live longer that way. Don't listen. I must let the bastards catch me again. Never! Wait. Oh. Who are you? It's just a memory. Drew? Is that you? So how do you know? From my tales of the Northmen, they call me Drew. A liar. An old fool. <laughs> truth is my truth. <laughs> it's good to see you again. You kept your vow. Guide you in this life and the next. I will tell you my stories of hell if I may walk with you. His facial animation is so again. good. I'm listening. So good. Seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye. And you too will see what's hidden in plain sight. Look at that. The lighting is so intense. Look closer. Look. Use your I can eyes. see one. Hold it in your mind's eye. Find one like it to open the gate. Also, I gotta find. It's a puzzle. You want me to go back? Or you want me to find one amongst all these? Maybe? I might be grasping at thin air. Here. I don't know. Can't hear the voices. Focus? They're saying focus, right? That's the big one, <laughs> obviously. Find one like it. I mean, there's lots and lots of of scribbles, but I can't really. I wouldn't know what to press if I saw it. Can I do something? Oh. I should not have done that. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's lots of them. It's near. Focus. You'll find it. I'm focusing. Towards the gate. Fair enough. Oh. That wasn't too bad. First puzzle down, right? 
The gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. It worked. I spent six years enslaved in hell. But I watched the Northmen. Learned their ways. I know you did. You listen? When everyone else laughed. My people paid the heavy price. Carry my stories with you. And together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Alright. So they're not Northmen. Which I, I take it are like Vikings, Nordic people. Another voice joins us. She wants to try to make them go away. Pretend they weren't real. What good is that? When we are always here. Oh. I guess it's the same with heights. You can stand on the edge. Pretend it's going to be okay. But you know that death is near. Waiting for you to make that oh, how do I? Oh. little slip. You can't just wish things away. There's not no button indicators or anything like that. And still it feels very intuitive. Somehow. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. The gods feared her bloodline, bad on her mother's side and yet much worse on her father's. So, as a child, the Allfather cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship and self-slaughter. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela can resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed, and with her you must bargain. So people who die like in battle and stuff, they don't go to Helheim because they they die a bit different. I think they go to uh, I don't remember the name. It's not like I'm not an enthusiast. And this, I just, we, I guess because we're from here, I, I spent a lot, like a lot, a lot of time in school uh, reading about this. And we made, you know, posters and plays and all that. Like plays, like, you know, what do you call it? We performed plays about it. It's crazy. Yeah, warriors, they go somewhere else when they die. To Helheim divides the living from the dead. Is that the face of Hela herself? The half-rotten goddess that rules over Helheim. Whatever horrors lie behind that door, she must find him. I have no idea what to expect here. Monsters?
someone coming. Oh, I could really use some button rights. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to run away. Okay, so there's a heavy attack. Let's do that. Kick him. Kick him. Kick him. Oh, oh snap. I wasn't too bad. If I can say so myself. Right in the face. And things turn dark. I don't know what that... Seem to be made up of fog now. Oh, oh God damn it. Come on, man. Come on. I can't see anything. It's just pitch black. <laughs> What's going on? What's happening? Oh, I didn't make it. That's terrible. A vision of what's to come. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain. It does not reason. It is rocked. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head, the seed of the soul, until there is nothing left of her. <laughs> All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. I'm not sure if I made it or if I lost. The dark rot will grow each time you fail. If the rot reaches Senua's head, her quest is over. Oh, I did not make it. And all progress will be lost. They drive a hard bargain. I'll take it. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow and soon it will take her soul. But for now, at least, she still has control of her mind. And she will fulfill her vow, whatever the cost. I really, really wish I would have made it. This feels like a bad place to start off from, with that, with a rod at hand, you know. Listen to me, Senua. The goddess Hela lies behind the gate to Helheim. To open the gate, you must first face the gods that guard it. The god of fire, Surt, and the god of illusion, Van Raven. Spill their blood to open the gate to Helheim and enter the land of the dead. That is a hardcore way <laughs> to announce what you must do. Spill their blood. 
I like that. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north, fiery hot to the south. They say the cold formed ice, which melted from the sparks from the south. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice, and the first giant was born, and was named Emir. The ice continued to drip, and the power of the void gave life to it, and it became a cow whose milk fed the giant. That's right, a cow, but you weren't expecting that. Well, <laughs> tales of creation uh, usually makes no sense. Uh, it doesn't really matter what culture you turn to, in my opinion. In my opinion. But a cow? Nah. I wasn't Val expecting that. Raven, ancestor of the seers and master of ravens. He hunts his prey with his powers of illusion and feasts on their remains. Oh. Follow the path to Valraven and defeat him in battle to earn his mark. The gate to Helheim cannot be opened without it. Without it. I like his accent. I wonder if it's just a fake one or if it's based on, you know. Like a real one. It's a bit... Sounds familiar. Natural. Let's go up here. There's no sprint... Oh yeah, there we go. Kinda neat, we can cover some more ground. Yes. Emir was a frost giant, a being of darkness, and all his sons and grandsons were dark after him. Of his daughters and granddaughters, some were monstrous, but others fair. But there was another who came from the ice, Buri. In shape, he was like a man, big and powerful. His son, Bor, took a fair giant to be his wife, and they had three sons. Odin was the eldest, and the Northmen hold him to be the foremost of the gods, the Old Father. All right. All right. Cool. Because Odin is like the, the big dog. It's cool that he, he is like a father and a grandfather. I didn't know that. At least I didn't remember it. That's cool. Alright, what was his name? Val Robin? He's going down. There's his mark. His mark is right there. There's a lot of other things to do. Alright, let's focus. Illusion hides the path to Valraven. Don't trust your eyes. Find another way to see the truth. I can do that, probably. Another puzzle. I have no idea. Um, it's a door. How much? How much of this is going to be puzzles? And, like, right off the bat, I feel like it's going to be puzzles and bosses. That seems like a good combination for this kind of storytelling. The visuals are great, not only like the lighting and the effects, but the design of things. I think this is really appealing to me, at least. Look at that. Oh. That's cool. It's funny. We all want to see behind the veil, don't we? Once we do, 
We mostly just close our eyes again and pretend what we saw was never really there. was a god of any sort I would like to have birds you know I would like to be god of the birds took a dark turn there it was, it was kind of sunny sun hi oh it's you again i i i remember you sorry oh. don't hurt me is that the guy is that no that wasn't or maybe it is i don't know no This one is tougher. No. Alright, come on. <gasps> I did it. Oh no, one more. I, I couldn't hear it. What did she say? There's too many. Find something. Never mind. There's not too many. He looks the same. We made it. That, that's neat. I'll look at the weather. Men will not stop her. She will find what she's looking for. It's cleared up. <laughs> Good news. Good news there. I'm happy. Not too happy about that rotten hand, though. It's weird. comes from ravens, allowing the ravens to break his magic seal. Show me what you have seen, Truth. Look how much it's changed. Yes. Those up there. I can kind of see how they how they can make that mark, but I don't. I I, th I think I need to get up higher. Can I climb? Here, can I to break the seal, 
Align the ravens with the mark of Valraven. Oh, I can go over here. Lovely. It's quite lovely. Oh. So I'm not sure all the all the voices in our head and the darkness, I'm not sure if that's like There we go. Is that a, a product of venturing to Helheim? Or is she sick? I get the feeling she's... Uh, she's sick. Because the voices said uh, some of them were old and they've always been there. And it's like they know her. And I feel like the voices are... Well, maybe some of them are from, you know, the surroundings and the circumstance. But it feels like as if some of them are inside her kind of do you feel it too this is the first crossing into another world that looks the same but feels different an imposter world where the forest itself is watching because yeah this is the first area, no? Let's go around here. Quite. There's red things hanging there, so I guess we gotta align those again. However, the case might be that we need to Another game. Another game. exactly go up and focus Stay back. It's on the gate. To break the seal, align the ravens with the mark of Valraven. There they are. Alright. So you gotta activate the. Um, the gate before. Oh! There's eyes in the stairs, man. Never mind. If I look through here. Yeah, what if I look. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. We're learning, we're adapting. Not sure if it did. Oh, yeah. Mother of Challenge me! <laughs> Is that the guy? Oh, he's nasty. He's gone. He disappeared. Where did he go? Where is he? Don't blame me, man. Listen, focus. You need to focus. Focus. Focus on what? Ah, <gasps> there it is. He's a nasty fellow. Eyes again. <laughs> and he's gone. Is she lost? Not lost. Um, lost sometimes it's hard to make out. She journeyed into the wilds of her native land. Living off berries, roots, and rabbits. It's not uncommon, you see. We call such a person a cat. Some like truth in search of penance. Others, like Senua, the purge a curse. Those who make it back are forever changed.
Oh, so now I took away the opening there. I can still go in here. Let's do it. Where? Oh, there he is. Yeah. He's freaky. I think this is freaky. Maybe I'm a... Maybe I'm a wimp. I find this very... Very unsettling. Especially the fact that he's not really looking at me, he's just kind of hovering there. Oh. The Northmen say that Odin and his brothers killed Ymir, and that the world of man was formed from his corpse. They made his bones into stone, and his flesh into earth and his blood into the salt sea. They set his skull to be the bowl of the sky with his brains for clouds. Odin and his brothers caught the sparks flying from Muspel and made them into stars. And to protect the new world from the giants, they used Ymir's great curving eyebrows as walls. How big was that dude? So that's the door. Right, let's go up the ladder, right? Confront him. Lost him again. Oh, yeah. Oh, look. She can get up now. She can get up now. Yes. She can get up now. She can get up. I like, I actually like the voices. Do. I think the voice acting is, Raven, is quite tricking. quite great. Raven, how can she get up? Bait. It's him. Dark magic draws her closer. It's not him. He's helping her. It's not him. It's a trick. She's doing it on her own. He's not tricking her. It's magic. It's an illusion. They're quite. They don't seem to be in, uh, in agreement on this particular matter. That's all right. I don't need their approval. Look at that. I hear something. If you hear the song of Valraven, follow it, and it will lead you to him. But be aware of his illusions. You can't always trust your eyes. Didn't really hear a song in there. I bet it starts. On the other side. This door. Alright, let's listen. We picture fear. And we think of a shadow in the woods. A creature in the night. If only it were that simple. The worst kind comes without warning. A deep and primal signal from within. A reminder that just because you cannot see the threat, it doesn't mean that it's not already here. I hear no song. I, I hear no song. Oh. Oh. oh Don't let them get behind you. No. I won't. I wouldn't do that, you know, either way. Let them get behind me. That is. I'm stuck. I can't 
can't kill things. Kind of stuck. Here we go. Oh, I don't want to fail again. I can't fail again. We're too rotted. We rotted more. Oh, we can get up. She's injured. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all right. She's a bit slower now. A bit clumpier. Maybe that's all right. Maybe. We oh, he's behind me now. That's. Not <gasps> I wonder if he, they regenerate. Oh, what's the deal with? He's down. Yeah, he's down. Okay, we can make this. We didn't rot. There are too many of them. Quite strong position. I don't know why. <laughs> the, the 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 Jeez. I don't know why, but the, the 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 combat is super intense. I think we made it though. I think the rot on the hand is still the same, right? Yeah. The Northmen say you must sacrifice in order to receive. They tell how the runes were revealed to Odin only in sacrifice. He hung himself from the world tree and he stabbed himself with a spear and he dedicated the sacrifice to himself. For nine nights he hung on the tree without food or drink and at last he saw the runes below him. He gave a cry and gathered them in his mind and learnt them. Then he fell from the tree. This mythology, it's intriguing. It's very, what do you call it? Very fairy tale like. I enjoy these little snippets of uh, storytelling. Still not hearing that song they were talking about. <laughs> Maybe it comes later on. Do you know what it's like to leave everything behind? Your home? Loved ones? To head deep into the wilds? Perhaps never to return? Senua does. Because when darkness speaks, it changes everything. Turning home into a foreign land and loved ones into strangers. Exile makes sense when you realize that you were never really home in the first place. There's a lot going on. Here. Like a lot, a lot. We'll figure it out though, right? Oh, there's a lot of birds. I bet he's in there. He's in there with all the birds. He's everywhere. The song. Bell Raven. Bell Raven's song. It's over here. It's over here. He's there. It's over there. It's over there. No. If you ladies. There's two. Which one? Listen. Listen. Focus. Listen. Focus. It's magic. It's magic. It's an illusion. She's been in a forest like this before. This reminds her. Somewhere. If you would pipe it down, Where? I might be able to hear Which this song. Forest? Forest in the, wilds. the wilds. She left Ian. She went to the wilds a long time ago. Why did she go to the wilds? 
She wanted to fight her own darkness. <laughs> she thought she could beat her own darkness. Did she beat her darkness? No. <laughs> it nearly killed her, but she tried. Druth. Druth helped her. If it wasn't for Druth, she'd she be dead. dead. Druth? She can't beat her own darkness. Druth seems like a good guy. Uh, I. She wanted to marry Dillian. She came to beat her own darkness and marry Dillian. And Mary Dillian, right, yeah. But she didn't work. She thought her curse would affect him. She thought her curse would spread to him. She thought she'd bring the darkness to him too. She nearly died. She thought the curse made her tainted. Druth helped her. Druth? I, I, I get the feeling we're not going to see a whole lot more of Druth. Because he's kind of a ghost or an illusion, but I really wish we would. I really do. Is that the song? Man. I, I don't hear anything. I don't. I don't. I'll try to... That's just laughter. That's not the song, right? And we can't go up there. Alright, so... I'm not hearing the song. get it. Can I run any faster? No. Jogging is where it's at. That's fine. Just fine. These voices, man. Such bitches. Superb. Superb. There he is. We'll have to... We'll have to check out the portal again. Because... Looking through the portal this opening here wasn't there and if that opening is not there and the wall closes we can probably walk on top of it right or we can reach mr birdman valrab all right great great we're gonna get up there next time we're gonna get up there and check out if he knows anything about the song great Thank you for watching. I'll see you see you next time.